Curious about who can hear your raid? Engage in your gunfight or detect your tree farming? In this comprehensive sound guide, we'll delve into every aspect of the game to ensure you're fully aware of the auditory landscape. Hey guys, Jafar here and let's get started. The game sets a strict limit of 310 meters, or about 2.1 squares for player generated sounds, including weapon noises. Beyond this range, players and their actions aren't rendered, so you won't hear them. Now, if you're testing sounds using a demo recording, remember this limit doesn't apply. So don't be fooled into thinking you can hear the sounds from further away than the limit that's set. To measure distance in the game, just hit an object with a projectile like an arrow or bullet. After that, press F1 to open the console and type in combat log. Wait about 10 seconds, then check the console. It'll show you how far your projectile traveled. And remember, one map square equals 150 meters. No matter what ammo you use, the max audible range for weapon sounds is 310 meters. At around 125 meters, the specific sound of a weapon firing changes to a generic thump. As you would expect, the quieter weapons like the nail gun and bow have a shorter sound range. If you want the quietest projectile weapon, go for the flamethrower. Its sound range is just 32 meters. But remember, anyone within that radius will hear your flame raid. And don't forget about the sounds of drawing a gun or reloading. Other players can hear these and they might give away your position if you're trying to be sneaky. We'll go through each gun one by one to understand how they sound at both close and far ranges. You know, using attachments can be a double-edged sword. They can alert players nearby because of the loud equipping sound that can be heard from 56 meters away. But they can also help you stay hidden, especially if you use the silencer which reduces all gun sound ranges to 38 meters. Just be careful with the flashlight and laser sight. Toggling them on and off can be heard from 10 meters away. When you're out farming, you might worry someone's listening. Most items make similar impact sounds that can be heard from 55 meters away. But the loudest sound? That's a tree falling over. Which can be heard from as far as 98 meters away. So be careful when chopping down trees near buildings. Larger explosives like rockets, timed explosive charges and satchels can be heard beyond the maximum sound range because the sound comes from the explosion itself, not the player who set it off. But quieter explosives like hand grenades, HE grenades, firing the missile launcher and the subtle noise of a flashbang have a more limited sound range.
Traps are not just lethal to players, but also serve as an alarm system, potentially alerting others to a raid in progress. Landmines have a surprisingly large audible range that can be heard from approximately 1,260 meters away. On the quieter end, we have a bear trap with an audible range of just 53 meters. Understanding the sound range of vehicles is crucial, as they often leave you exposed. The submarine is the quietest vehicle with an audible range of 25 meters both underwater and on the surface, perfect for stealth missions. Cars are slightly louder with a sound range of 50 meters when driving and 54 meters when honking the horn. Tugboats can be heard from 50 meters away, while other boats can be heard up to 80 meters away, so it's best to stay at least that far from shore to avoid detection. If you choose the train as your transport mode, keep in mind it can be heard from 180 meters away. Underground metro trains produce the same level of noise and can pass through to the surface. Air vehicles like minicopters, scrap helis and attack helis have an audible range of 200 meters. If you crash one of these vehicles, the resulting explosion can be heard from as far as 790 meters away. For the events, we have the heli, Bradley APC, airdrop plane, cargo ship, and Chinook. The cargo ship's horn has the furthest audible range at 1,750 meters, but since it's offshore, most of the sound would dissipate over the sea. The airdrop is next, with an audible range of 1,700 meters. By the time it completes its flyby, most players will have heard it. The helicopter has a range of 1,440 meters, giving players plenty of time to prepare, but to hear its explosion or gunfire, you'll need to be closer. The Bradley tank has varying sound ranges depending on its weapons. Its secondary machine gun is the loudest at 980 meters, while its primary explosive turret is quieter. To detect Bradley based on engine noise, you'll need to be at least within 120 meters. Lastly, we have the Chinook helicopter, which can be heard from 520 meters away. Here's a visual representation of each event's loudest audible sound. Walking barefoot or in shoes can technically be heard at the same distance of 30 meters, both on grass and a foundation. However, different shoes make different sounds, which might make them harder for some people to hear. Be careful when jumping, as this can be heard much further, at 54 meters. Surprisingly, bushes don't make any sounds for other players, even though they do for you when walking through them. When you're inside your base and someone is lurking outside, you might move quietly so as to not alert them. 
but deploying a chest can be heard from 27 meters away and opening it doesn't produce any sound that other players can hear. Turning on a furnace can be heard from around 25 meters away, while the sound of opening a door carries up to 27 meters. Be cautious when healing as other players might hear this sound and rush your location. Healing outdoors can be heard from 6 meters away. If you're indoors, players outside cannot hear you healing. Eating is slightly louder. It can be heard from 24 meters away if you're inside and 30 meters away if you're outside. With voice volume set to 100%, your voice can be heard from 60 meters away. But using a megaphone extends this range to 100 meters. Oh my god. <laughs> Both the sound effects of upgrading and destroying buildings have a range of 56 meters. This info can help you gauge how far away you need to be to listen for decaying bases or ensure your curious neighbor doesn't hear you building. Interestingly, when underground, your gunshots are completely muted, with only the impact sounds being audible from 55 meters away. However, this doesn't apply to explosions. Finally, using monuments can be an efficient way to gather resources quickly, but may alert other players around you. Both the quarry and pump jack have an operating sound range of 87 meters. For larger monuments like the excavator, players can hear you from as far as 540 meters away. Finally, if you decide to start using the recycler, other players can hear it from 30 meters away. And that's it. Thanks guys for watching and I hope to see you in the next one.